The Laguna Playhouse Youth Theater season is about to begin and joining me on the stage of the theater is the director, Donna and Glima, and we have the author, playwright, and music composer for the first show of the season, Looking for Home, Mary Murphitt. Donna, you have worked all over the country, but I know you are loving Laguna Playhouse because this is not your first production, is it? No, not my first production, Scott. I, this will probably be production number 31 or 32. I think I've lost count. So with 30, 31, do you have any favorites? Uh, you know, I would have to say all of the shows that I've worked on are favorites, and, but some highlights I think that you're going to see are uh, from Godspell. from High School Musical. And uh, just a number of shows that we've done. We have entertainment for the entire family. The Youth Theater has been around I think as long as the Playhouse has been around. At least that's what our research shows us. And the Playhouse is 90 years old this year. It's just amazing. Raising funds now for the theater, it must not be as easy in this economy. So do you ever have any fundraisers or anything coming up in the near future? Thank you, yes, we do have fundraisers. In fact, our first fundraiser is a rummage sale. And we're gonna do that in conjunction with the production of Looking for Home. So we're, that's happening on November 5th. And then later on in the winter time, we're going to have a murder mystery it's our fifth annual murder mystery, and uh, it's full of music, it's full of you know, audience participation, and it's, it's performed by members of our youth conservatory program. It's a very fun, ex exciting gala evening with auction items and uh, raffles. It's wonderful. But I am excited about the shows for this season, which is starting really quick. We're talking November 4th, the season begins. So what are the shows for the season we're gonna see? Well, of course, we're doing Looking for Home this fall. And then in the winter time, uh, February time, we're going to do t uh, two fairy tales together in one evening, Hansel and Gretel and Cinderella. But these are new adaptations. They're very funny, sharp, very stylistic, good for the whole family. And then later on in the year, we're doing our Theater for New Generation performance of the Giver, which is based on a book written by Lois Lowry, Newbery Award winning book. November 4th, we are going to be starting out with Looking for Home. And Mary, we are so lucky to have you on the show. So can you tell me a little bit about Looking for Home? It deals in part with a program that the Children's Aid Society created uh, called, it was referred to later as the Orphan Train Movement. And they took kids off the streets of New York City who had been abandoned or were in orphanages, put them on trains, and, put, and took them out to the Midwest and placed them in homes, mostly in farm families, like farm communities. Um, and this ran from around the time of the Civil War up until the Depression when people couldn't afford to bring another child in. And what happened to these kids, some, you know, some, were, uh, some were used like, as slave labor on farms, that didn't go so well, but there were some kids like Anna, who is the star of this show, who was a woman I knew in my hometown in Kansas. What is the best way to get the tickets? We have the website, right? That's right, website. You can go to the home page and click right on and buy a ticket. Right, so it's lagunaplayhouse.com. It is. And do you know the phone number, Donna? So I you can do. tell our audience. I do, I'm they're, ready. They're going to get the phone right now, and they're going to be picking up because the tickets are going to sell out, and it's only running from the 4th through the 13th. So what's the phone number, Donna? 949-497-2787, okay. and then hit extension 1 right to the ticket office. I'm just loving it here. I feel like I could stay on stage. You know what I'm actually going to do? I'm going to probably stay out front until the 4th because I want to make <laughs> sure I get in and see this show. You guys, you're unbelievable. 